Hey guys, it's King Killer. Finally coming at you with my Blackfoot and Cayman Ammunitions Guiding Tutorial. Uh, I'm not going to teach you how to gun in this. That's going to be something you'll have to learn through experience, practice, and never giving up because it is a challenge. Um, I've been lucky to play this mod a lot and have some guys that love to fly these types of choppers that are willing to do that frequently over and over again with me. So that I've had a chance to really improve my gunning while moving in these things. And we, we really take the gunships and we we use them offensively. We don't like camping high in the sky. We like flying low over the AO, 600 meters maybe, taking out tanks. But we also like taking out infantry. It makes a huge impact on the game. Sometimes you can call out large squads of enemy AI or enemy infantry for your teammates on the ground. Um, but my main focus today is going to be munitions and some targeting tips. So right now this is some Blackfoot gameplay where Apex is flying. Uh, we do a lot of infantry targeting in this. Um, I did take out a couple hunters maybe. I tried to take out a chopper. I even daggers. I tried to wire guide some get daggers at a group of infantry at one point. But we're flying over the AO at 240 kilometers an hour at 120 meters. And I think we get like 10 kills maybe in one run. So on the Blackfoot, you have the short-range anti-air missiles that lock on to ground vehicles and air vehicles. Now you got to look at your helicopter and basic armor 3 controls, T will target a enemy that you're looking at. Not an enemy, a vehicle that you're looking at. Now with the ARAMs, you want to use those on air vehicles only. Uh, you only get four of them. I don't even recommend shooting down Pawnees unless they're engaging you. I think you can use the 20 mil cannon for that. The 20 mil cannon, you get a thousand rounds. It's got a super high rate of fire. It's a lot less damage um, per radius than the Cayman 30 mil, but it is a still lethal cannon because of its fire rate, especially against helicopters and sometimes even jets when the scenario demands it. Um, this is me wire guiding the rockets actually. You can sound, kind of see how that didn't work out for me. I only got like two guys out of that group and then I switched to the cannon again. And I, I, I think personally the 20 mil cannon, it's harder to get infantry kills with. I don't think the Blackfoot is as good against infantry as the Cayman, but the Blackfoot is a force to be reckoned with. I mean, you can go and change the pace of the game because you can take out so many pieces of armor so quickly. Um, the other targeting tip I have is for the daggers. Um, Daggers lock on to ground targets. You can wire guide them by not targeting anything. You use T for this when you're looking at a tank. Now the other thing I've le learned is that you have a radar lock, R. Radar lock cycles through the radar contacts in front of you from 10 o'clock to 3 o'clock, if that makes sense. Your helicopter has to be generally facing, but it'll go through all the ground targets. So when I'm in the black, but I'm constantly pressing R when I have my daggers out. And my pilot is too. Whenever you have your daggers out, your pilot can do the same thing to look for targets. If you have your ARAMs out, you can scan an air targets. If you have your gun out, your captain gun, your missile pod wings go in and your helicopter actually moves faster. That's only on the Blackfoot. But yeah, that pretty much sums up all the ammo for the Blackfoot. I personally think the 20 mil is a great infantry cannon sometimes, but more importantly, it's a good secondary anti-air defense. I think your anti-air rockets are great for jets and in emergency scenarios, good for attack choppers coming at you. And I think the daggers are really great for ground and pound on tanks and stuff. Now, they're not nearly as strong as the anti-tank guided missiles in the Cayman, but you get 24 of them. So yeah, Tigris takes like five rockets, Cheetah takes like six, Varsic takes like 12. I mean, it really sucks too because you can't necessarily control where you're going to hit them unless you approach them from a specific angle. And, and you know, the best case scenario, yeah, you've planned it out that well, but let's be honest, it's war. You're not going to really get to play to your plane. Sometimes you just have to fire 12 rockets right into the front of the bar so you blow them up, and it sucks. But yeah, then there's the Cayman. Now, the Cayman is my true favorite attack chopper because the 30 mil can, you only get 250 round high explosive rounds. You get 250 armor piercing rounds, and then you get, I think it's 36 Skyfires that the pilot controls, and then 8 ATGMs, the anti tank guided missiles. The ATGMs are super fucking powerful. It's pretty much a one hit kill on any tank if you hit it from above. I've had to hit the 
Kuma twice, maybe. Um, twice at the most. Those things are seriously destructive. The 30 mil armor piercing rounds are your only anti air in this thing. I mean, you don't have an anti air at all, you have your gun. So, your pilot really is your, is your dude in this chopper. He's letting you know that things are getting close and you're taking them out. You're trying to. The armor piercing rounds are they're faster and they have less drop than the HEs, but they are like if you hit a mohawk in the side of the mohawk, you're, if it's full, you're gonna get like people because they just rip right through. It's like putting a whole strip through a piece of paper. It doesn't rip the whole thing in half, blow it up, but it needs puncture right through it. So if anybody's in that area when a bullet goes through, it's dead. The shells are also really effective against jets that have the balls that come straight at you if you're a better gunner than me because I always miss this shot and I don't know why but I suck at it. Um, the anti-tank guided missiles are also wire guided so if you see like a large group of infantry you can still nail them with one ATV. I don't recommend that because the 30 mil HE Gatling gun things a beast. I mean one area in a five foot radius of the guy. I'm sorry one shell in a five foot radius of the guy and Die. Things it's on a different scale than the black one. So if I had to compare the two, I would honestly I don't know that I could. I think a Blackfoot is a armor and air vehicle, and the Cayman is an armor and infantry vehicle. Not vehicle, gunship. Jeez, I'm on fire. But I think they're different calibers, different weapons. Um, you can change the pace of the game if they have a bunch of armor with the Cayman, just like you can with the Blackfoot. Came in, you don't have AA, so you have less long term potential, in my opinion. The Blackfoot is like flying a bathtub. You have less maneuverability, but it's like a flying fucking tank. You have so many great options for taking out enemies. So I can't say one is better than the other. It's a scenario oriented situation. It depends on what you need. Honestly, if you have the guys, I'd say you get one of each. It's a really good combination. Or two black feet are also pretty People can't do anything about it if there's two of them sometimes. They just can't get the tank outside of the safe zone in time to blow you up. They can't get the man pad up before you're taking them out. So I think this, this is a pretty good basic guide. I think the main thing is that people use R to target as well as T. Cycle your radar locks. Wait for the yellow font to pop up in the left hand corner and let you know what it is. You don't want to waste an anti-tank guided missile on a quad bike. You don't want to waste an anti-tank guided missile on a spec transport. You have the 30 mil armor piercing rounds. Line up your shot and blow that thing up. And then when all, or take out the tires and when the guys get out, use your lethal 30 mil. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm going to continue with some gameplay, kind of showing off some of these tactics, techniques, and procedures. Um, I say I'm a lot because I want to make sure that I'm not repeating myself, and then I end up repeating myself anyway. I love you guys. Thanks for loving me and forgiving me for my homes. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will catch you next time. almost forgot. The, the scenarios for the Blackfoot, I don't recommend doing it at the beginning of the game, or the Cayman at the beginning of the game. Um, I think it's a lot more effective towards the end because then you also have the chance for the bonus and people get crazy with their vehicles. In this video, the one I'm showing right now and the ones that follow it to the end of this, look at the score. Right now it's 64 to, uh, I can't see it. I have my quality on my previous solo. Hold on. Um, okay, sorry. It's 60 to 30 to 33. We have 30 points. I mean, this is about to be one of the biggest comebacks ever. They get to 99. Op 4 gets to 99. And we stay in this game in this Blackfoot this whole time. I mean, this is why they are effective. This is why it's a game changer. You get people that are unopposed in the air like this, or that are rich enough to not be opposed, and they can change the game. Uh, Sarge kind of talked about this in his video. We called him a multiplier. And this is what this is. I mean, I come into this game at this point, this is my first life, and I'm going to leave this game with 106 kills. It was an amazing run with Mamba. 
Thank you, ground support team. Thank you, Mamba. Best game I've ever had, and it was all in a Cayman. No. I messed up! No. I messed up bad! I wasn't feeling it in my bones, I don't... What's that? Oh, that's a Karoo, and then we got a Jet still. So, yep. I'm just gonna say this, but, um... I thought I saw feet behind a wooden door. So I kinda, like, opened the door and shot through the door at the same time. And there was nobody there. You're hallucinating. You're hallucinating. Not a good game today. Not a good game. Want to get four that to the right. right. He's on the line for the base. I don't know if he's fair game. Right here. Yep, yep, yep. Let's go over here, I was gonna buy a tank. Okay, gate. So there, there, yeah, they're just in their gate. Oh. I was. There's something right in front of us. I to ask you if you could laser designate for me, but then that's the fucking cheetah shot from their spawn. Never mind, it was just yeah. a lot well, I killed. It's not just gonna break me. I, I, I can't even live for three minutes. Oh, well, you can command for me if you want. No, fuck that. <laughs> Armed helicopter can assist. Fuck the what? Well, what the hell did we hit? Alright, I'm out of sky fire, so I'll just line you up and shot them. Give me, give me another run just opposite of where you just went. Because there's a shitload of guys spread out. They are meat for my rifle. She's I don't know what just opposite means, but I think I know what you mean. <laughs> just turn around all straight. Then. Oh, okay, right, right. Same line. Yep. Sure. Alright, Oh, uh, HMG, right? My nose got something on a stick. Down. What? Did that really not kill it? I fucking hit it with an ATJM. Yeah, we got a body on our six of things. You're gonna suck my dick. Maybe not, I think. Gun, gun nice, okay. Dude, I holy shit, we got a lot of air cards. Two air, yeah, yeah. I killed one. Get him. Do you wanna go for it? No, no. Not those guys. Contact gunship two kilometers north. Great. Fuck yeah, we got something on our ass. Uh, Orca. Where'd he go? Uh, it's Orca, he's up high. Fuck him. He's not agile enough to keep up with him. Holy shit, we got a lot of things in there. Wrong target. I think we got another shoot up. Blue for There is a A-10 flying over you, Glenn, coming right at us. We're not clear yet. Well, good, because this guy is... Oh, man, I could have fucked him up so good! We are Damn it! Though. Should I turn around or what? There's a helicopter driving in. I learned my lesson with jets, man. You don't go pick in the fight. I'm not that good. I miss him most of the time. It's aggravating. Yeah, he's back on our base. Okay, he's coming in hot. Alright, turn around, turn around. I'm gonna wait for you guys. Really? Just driving. Like. It's like that. Oh, yeah, he is. Headshot. My one shell.
my name's been sure. Alright. In between our guys and the office buildings. I got... No, no, no. Don't waste rockets. Don't waste rockets. Not enough. Games. I lost them too. I got one. <laughs> wow, nice. Dude, if we come back and win this game, it'd be amazing. Very good thing. I need 10 more kills. Oh my gosh. What these vehicles? Dead. 10 guys in one? Fucking. Oh, it's a tank. Hell yeah. Because it said quad bike before I hit it. Air contact coming in left. No eye. Whoa, it looks like a, a transport vehicle or something. Nope, that bitch is angry. Oh, it is, it is a... I think it's dead. I'm sick of this mouse. It's killing me. Something else on our sick. Yeah, I saw that. There's only the tower guy. Oh, no. It's uh, close. It's a hummingbird. It's underneath. Another one. This bitch is gonna land. Yes, he is. He's gonna totally... Nope. He's gonna drop a bunch of guys over the water. That's what he's gonna do. <laughs> Full hard left so I can kind of see the AO. One off in the cockpit, what? man. Sorry. That is Later. Later. Our middle, our main rotor is just completely gone. I don't know if this is saveable. Is it? You think? I don't know. I honestly don't. I think if we do it, it's gonna blow up. <laughs> He's gonna respawn. <laughs> yep. You were waiting for that, weren't you? <laughs> Son of a bitch. Yes, I had the shot lined up for quite a while. I will buy you. Uh, he cool. just landed on the other uh, side cool. of town. I, need money. I will buy you so many things. No! Oh, I thought the game was over. What the fuck just what happened? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> you crack head. What it... the fuck? Are we back? Yes, yes, Google, we need you. We only need five more points. He keeps getting for like five minutes. Dude, they need to get in the AO so bad. <laughs> they must be trying so hard. <laughs> I don't. I don't feel bad. No, no, exactly. I don't feel bad at all. This is great. <clears throat> Keep desperately trying to make it into the AO frantically. Uh, same spot, dude. As last, I fired a rocket there on accident, but I'm gonna guide it in. At general area. God, I did friendly. We got friendlies all over. No. Dude, we got friendlies all over. Yeah, over here, over here. Not friendlies, not friendlies. My tower three, my tower three. Which one's tower three, friendlies, right? Uh, we have three friendlies. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this <laughs> is amazing. <laughs> they had us beat fucking by ten players. I literally, they were like, it was 45 players on their team and 35 on ours, and then 15 on Blue Fort. Uh, there's two hummingbirds coming in from up for one pony chasing them. <laughs> Oops! What? I tried to kill a friendly there. Who did we? Holy shit, look at all the air targets. Yeah, fuck. <laughs> There's a lot of them. Jet going down, it looks like. Friendly jet. Hummingbird. Something coming in out for. Down hummingbird. Something coming in blue for, too. Uh, armor? I 
can't see it it's going in and down, not a big though. No, it's it's not armor, but it's something coming out for it. Something coming out for it. On the road. Off road. Off road. Yeah, it's still off for it. We still have to Dead. Oh nice. I wasted a rocket on that. A ten coming in from all the uh, um blue four. There's two of them. Yeah. Yeah. Oh shit. Well, uh, don't move much. I, I think I might be able to get a shot on this A10. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, did I really not tear him a new asshole? Cause I'm a little disappointed. He like gave his butt right to me. He was like, I almost hit him with me. that shit. Or did I hit him? No, no, no. We got something here, ground track underneath. We're gonna lose the game, we need to focus on infantry! Fuck. Oh no! I don't know where they are! No! Yes! Fuck you guys! Yes! <laughs> that, was <how laughs> that was how you do it! Get so many guys in there. <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe that, that was worked. So worth it. That, that was, was so, worth, so it. worth it. Oh yeah. Nice and 40, slow. Nice 000. and slow. Yeah. Twenty-eight thousand. That means whoever the pilot is gets a bigger bonus in the end. <coughs> Enough to make me a level 17 and only need 20 experience for an 18. <laughs> Woo! Yes! So glad they stayed in the AO. I'm a